Hello everyone and welcome to the next episode of P4. Today's crime prevention discussion is going to be with none other than tonight's show host, Jimmy Fallon. Jimmy, thanks for being here. What, me? Jess, thank you for having me here. It's actually Jason. Some people might call me Jace, but if Jess works for you, I'll go with it. Look at how many people showed up. Unbelievable. <laughs> Sold out uh, with, with no one. It's definitely not The Tonight Show, but we do what we can. Okay. So I guess by now you're familiar with what we do here on the show. This is actually a great idea. Well, thanks, Jimmy. You down for this? I sure am. Let's jump right in. A recent crime trend we're seeing here is people not getting money stolen from their cars or their houses, but actually directly from their cell phone. Go, what is the problem? Okay, Jimmy, let me ask you something. What do you think I would say to you if I found out you just lent your phone to strangers, somebody you didn't know? You <laughs> idiot. And that's not what I would say. I would say that we've all been guilty of it because you know what? We want to help somebody who needs it. Sure. So let's say you're at a gas station and you're not really paying attention to your surroundings. And what you don't notice is the guy in the background, he's- like he's wandering, like in the background. That's right. And he's there trying to pick out who his next victim might be. Uh, they know exactly what to do for everything. That's exactly right. So they come up to you and say, hey, I need to, to call a friend for a ride or I need help. And so they ask to borrow your phone. No. But once they get the phone, it's already unlocked. So they have access to all your apps. They open up the Venmo, the Cash app, and all they do is transfer money to their own app. Oh gosh, all right. And then you're out hundreds of dollars. Just don't do this anymore, like I don't know. I, I got... And that's exactly what we're saying, don't do this anymore. When you hand over your phone unlocked to a stranger, they've got access to too much personal information and your money. And if you just feel like you really wanna help them, offer to make the phone call for them or send that text for them. And also make sure you have that extra security measure set up within the app. Sure. So is that real enough talk for you? I always want it to be real. And so do we. I have an idea for a reality show. I don't think we're quite ready for something like that, but I'm thinking P4 bit with Pete's and Webster on The Tonight Show. <laughs> Not sure if that was a yes or a no, but I feel like we've at least established a pretty good rapport, huh? I wanna hang out with you. Like and you're welcome anytime back to Charlotte. And we just became really best friends. And you heard it right here with my new friend, Jimmy Fallon. We're asking that you don't give your phone to strangers, but if you do, make sure you have that secondary security feature in place within each app, especially your sensitive apps. And that's gonna do it here for this episode of P4, and we will see you next time.